YouTube, Nika Toki here. Um, I, first off, before I even get started with this video, I'm so, so, so sorry that I haven't been recording or putting anything up. I started school here maybe three, four weeks ago now, and it's just, I've been kind of crazy trying to keep things up in there, and my camera's doing nothing. So, I'm sorry for not posting anything or doing any activities, and I'm just, yeah. Secondly, I'm sick. Kind of. I just have a sore throat, a cough, and that crap. I'm drinking green tea, so deal with that in the video. <clears throat> Anyways, um, I have a updated phone case collection for you guys because I got some new phone cases. Uh, one of them, which I'll show you right now because, um, why not? This one I got when I took my brother back to college. It's a two-piece case, the hard plastic part, and then the silicone part. And I just got a mex message. Yeah, excuse my English right now, but silicone part and everything. So yeah, that's that case. Um, and I'm using this lovely, very classic ice cream container bucket, cleaned out obviously, for all my phone cases. These, the ones that are in here are just my dollar store cases and the three, my British flag case, the teddy bear case, and the pug case, so. Yeah, give me a moment. Okay, I just had to answer that message. It was kind of important. Anyways, moving on. Uh, starting off the first phone case that I have. Well, okay, I'm like, okay, I'm off track right now. Okay, so a few days ago on September 2nd, it was my birthday, and then the Sunday after that, the Sunday after, a few days later, I had my party on Sunday, which was like September 6th, I think it was. I'm not sure. I don't even care about looking at the calendar right now. Anyways, but September 6th, I had my party, and I got some new phone cases for it, and that was really exciting. So, starting off with the first case, I have a clear phone case, and... I, it's very hard to see, I'm sorry. It's a TPU case, so it's like a hard silicone or thing. And I wanted one because I love making phone cases. I do that for this phone that I'm recording with right now. And like I just make a template out of the back of my phone. And I just kind of go on and I cut out the shapes and do designs that I like. I'm just going to quickly go through, you know, these cases because they're just like quick. I'm still working on some of them. I'm going to be making more definitely because it's entertaining and it's very relaxing. And yeah, this is a splatter paint one, which I really like because it's rainbow. Yeah. And then the next one, if I even grab it. Yes, okay. And then this one's actually another rainbow case and it goes in the dark and it's pretty freaking cool. So that's that one. Uh, I'm gonna remake this phone case right here, which I'm about to show you guys, because just like, I tried to do a border thingy around it, and it didn't come out very well, but it's like my last, my other phone case, I don't know if I even showed you guys, it's just a sun that says I'll burn everything you love, and yeah, I really like this case, so I have to remake it though. And then this one with the really crappy saying, music gives me life, I like it, but I kind of messed up doing the border, like the outlining part. And so, like, it's underneath the camera hole right here, that thing, so. I like it still, it's very pretty, especially the watercolor and everything. I made all these cases, so yeah. And then I'm going to have to remake this one too, or at least make another one. It's supposed to be a Fallout Boy, Fallout Boy case, but I kind of forgot the crown, and that angers me very much. And then this one I did with acrylic paint. Because I want to try it, and I actually like the way it came out. I have to put my phone on this because it won't stay flat otherwise, so. Gonna message again. It's like just a galaxy case, but I really like the way it came out, to be honest, so yeah. That's that. Take that out. I'm gonna pause again to answer my message. Alright, and so that's it for the clear case for, um, with all the other cases. But this is what it would look like just normally on my phone. There'd be like a couple air bubbles because I don't know why there just is, but just a simple nice case. And it does give very nice protection all around the sides and towards the front. And yeah. The next
next case, it comes with a little dust plug. I need to find that real quick. Give me one moment, please. Again. <laughs> okay, it fell, and I can't find it because it's the color of my floor, my carpeting, which is black. Yeah. Anyways. I was really happy that my mom got me this case. It's a Hello Deary case, and it is just so freaking adorable. Okay? And then here's the back of it, featuring my horrible nails. But the th reason why I had to look for something for it, and it's all dusty, I apologize for it, is that it comes with a cute little dust plug. And when you're not using the dust plug, there's a side, there's like a little hole in the side of its face, so you can just put it in there. <laughs> it's so cute, and I love it. It's the most adorable case I have right now. Besides my pug one and my bear one. But it's like something I could just wear into school and people will compliment it more, I guess. But I have to leave the dust plug here at my home because I, I don't want to lose it. It's so small and it's easy to fall out. I'm just like, I don't want to lose it. So, there's that case. And if you want it, it's called um, Hello Deary. And I have the packaging still for all my cases, so let me go grab those real quick. Okay, so the clear case just came in this this case, or this packaging, really. I'm not sure if I'm even not supposed to be showing these. I don't know. And then the Hello Deary case came in this packaging. I have to put my hand in this, because... Yeah. Actually, no, I don't. I came in this case and it's like in literally the shape of a cat, which is adorable. And then, uh, it just explains how big it is and everything. Yeah. The fake cats. Sorry, I never even paid attention much to like what the packaging was, so just kind of reading it. And then inside the Hello Deary case, it, almost, it also came with this, um, little thingy it's from I guess this case is from Hong Kong I'm not sure and here's the back of that so yeah that's that one and then my last case I'm gonna do a review on it probably sometime soon I don't know when but I was so so happy when I got this it's a red pepper Waterproof or life proof phone case. I just use it for the water, really. As I wanted, I've always wanted to take my phone with me to the bath, but couldn't. So, too much information. I'm sorry. <laughs> but this is a packaging for its red pepper, as I mentioned, and everything. And then there's a headphone extension for it, but I don't even use that because I, I don't have any use for it. <laughs> Well, it's a really cool case, and I might, I actually, yeah, I might put it off on my phone. So, I'm gonna just talk and assemble it and everything. And I have to use, like, a really crappy credit card thing. I'm not showing anything, so I'm just, like, doing it back here. Because it's really hard to pry it open, but that's a good thing, because it means it'll stay protected underwater. So, yeah. Um, all three cases, the Hello Dairy one, I remember, was, like, about $10. My Life Proof one was, or the one that I'm opening right now, is also, like, $10, $11. Ow, that hurt my finger. And then the clear case, I think, was, like, 3 or $4, because I remember because I linked them all to my mom, so <laughs> she got them for me, and I was happy and all that. I just wipe off my screen so it's like now I'll cover no fingerprints so I put this in the case. But it's just like a really nice protective case and everything. Especially it's, it's fine for water stuff. English. Thinking. This thing right here is to protect your headphone jack so this way you know you don't get water in it. Because it's a point of waterproof. I'm not making sense right now, I apologize. Make sh I'm just making sure this is on correctly. Yeah, it is. I had a 
really hard time trying to figure out how to open this and close it. And I'm lucky my boyfriend was here with me because he just like kind of shut it for me so I could do the underwater test because you have to do this. You have to do a underwater test for at least one hour to and make sure like no water gets in this and everything. So yeah. But my phone's in here. I'm gonna blind you guys. This is my oh my gosh, I changed it so now this is really cute for my background. I will do a update what's on my phone. Probably after I upload this one because why not? But it's like protected everywhere. So it's waterproof. I will make a separate video of a test on this. Um, the one thing that I really hate though is that if the water is like extremely cold. You can't really like use the screen much. But I kind of understand because it's cold water. And then sometimes like the hot water, if it like t hits it hard enough, it will like open up random things on you. And you think, oh my gosh, something around my phone. But it's just nothing's wrong with it. As long as you do the test and everything, so yeah. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, the buttons are hard to press. Like, you have to force it down and everything. Like, you can't just, like, lightly tap it or anything. I have to force it down. And sometimes I just end up pressing, like, the little home button here. And yeah, those... But the volume buttons, it's easy to press. It's a really a huge pain to just press the button. But that's all for my update, phone cases and everything. Um, I will be making a video probably, like I said, probably after I make this one, of a uh, updated what's on my phone. And that's really all. Thank you guys for watching. I love, very, I love you all very much and I'll see you in my next video.